Magisters are probably humanity's real hope, don't you think? be fine for a while, all right? Sorry, I wasn't able to help you at the excavation. To be honest, I'm not sure if my functions, I mean, my skills, are at full capacity. It takes a huge amount of RK to maintain the Kuiper retroreflective active camouflage. It feels like my prosthesis and I are both slowly reaching our limits. But, if the Ironheart is within our- The guide said that Ironheart particles are the fundamental clues we need to track it. They're kind of like footprints that the Ironheart leaves behind, wherever it goes. I compared the location of these footprints to the recon intel. We should find more conclusive data as we continue to follow the traces. I'll send the details of the zone you'll need to cover to your receive. The remaining zones will be covered by colon- The Vulgus Munitions Factory. It truly is an ominous and horrifying place. Can you feel that? I can experience a variety of sensations through the Archie of Descendants. Including the phantom pain you feel. That's for me to deal with, Guide. Don't poke your nose in where it's not wanted. Once I've dealt with my personal target, then I'll ask you to remove the pain. You refer to the Vulgus you were pursuing. Ironheart traces. 
Once I complete analysis of the composition of the wastewater, I should know why I can detect iron heart particles. Then we'd better retrieve the data quickly. It will only be available for a limited amount of time. Wastewater is composed of Kuiper extracts and bulgous electrolytes. The Arnhart particles are most likely bound between those two substances. That's why they were detected intact and not dispersed. If we can find the source of that wastewater, we can trace them more accurately. I have a place in mind. processing facility. To analyze the particle flow, we need to take a closer look inside.
Where are all their forces coming from? Investigating traces of the Ironheart, we've discovered a zone in the factory area that looks to have been recently expanded. Considering the circumstances, I think it's highly likely that there's an Ironheart inside. Requesting approval for further investigation. Approval granted, but proceed with extreme caution. A large assault ship has been spotted in the airspace above the area. Based on the ship's class, we think it's the same one that we saw Corel board. Either he's there in person, or something worthy of his attention is happening. We should be prepared for a challenging situation. We may need to deploy more descendants. Over and out. Sharon, do we have any tactical weapons that are capable of destroying the entire Vulcus industrial area? If the Iron Heart is here, we may be able to investigate after destroying the enemy's facilities. <laughs> it's an interesting idea, Guide. But if it were possible, we would have already done it. Unfortunately, we don't have the capabilities to create such a powerful weapon. The anti-air gun in the Albion mountain range is probably our heaviest hitter. That's why the Descendants and the Ironheart are humanity's last hope. Closing the dimensional wall to isolate Ingress from the Colossi and the Vulgus. That would be the ultimate tactical weapon. Anyway, we don't have time to chat. Let's head to the restricted zone.
humanity is very weak. That's why humans need us so desperately. child. What do you need? This operation, it's just...
I've been expecting you. I have to finish my... I've reviewed the most recent battle report. What was it like coming face to face with Corel? <sighs> I mean, I barely made it out alive. He may not have shown it, but he was worried about you. Hmm, Alpha? I was. And I want you to take it easy for a while. Try a different mission. Have a look at this. Hmm? What are these? We discovered them when we were going through records of past operations. These ones seem to involve your parents, so I'm hoping you'll look into them. Records about... my parents? Remember what my parents looked like. When I think about my childhood, I only remember being with my grandmother. Why are you giving me this now? I'm fine. I'm fully recovered. I'd like to be assigned to a different operation. Honey, this is an order. Ugh. It won't be easy to find and restore these records. I've assigned you this because you're the best person for the job, and I expect you to do your best. All right. I guess I'll do it. Good. Don't forget I'll need progress reports. And you can ask Nell if you need anything. <sighs> Fine. Leave it to me. soldiers, but I had no idea they were involved in such a top-secret operation. These files are pretty unclear. I need to find more operation records. If I follow the trail, I might be able to find a lead or two.
Brown Beer Tavern is the best in the whole of Albany. What? You don't agree? <laughs> You're obviously new here, but trust me, a glass of... Descendant, I can detect both iron heart particles and its pulse in this zone. It keeps moving. If you and Charlotte can widen the range of also, however, in order to- Let's think about that later, if we make it out alive. If the Volgas have a large assault ship, they'll soon be pouring into this place. Number 17 and I will operate in stealth mode. You stay sharp. location.
You're too late. All experimental data has been deleted. Not all of it. There's a cache of records about the most recent experiments. It's not ideal, but I'll try to restore it as best I can. In the meantime, you and I might as well follow the Iron Heart particles.
that the supplies have been destroyed. Now go secure the weapons research data.
can sense the Ironheart pulses more clearly now. It is puzzling that I cannot directly detect the energy, but I will know why when we find the origin of the pulses.
Ascendant. I have pinpointed the location where all of the Ironheart traces converge. It is hidden within the facility of the Legion of Immortality. I can detect a continuous Ironheart pulse and particles. I recommend we investigate this place. Sharon, I will stay behind and retrieve the cache of Volga's experiment records. I'm sure they'll contain valuable information. I'll enter the inner facility first. Join me when you're ready. Most of the main passageways are now either blocked or destroyed. It appears the enemy intends to destroy the entire facility. Air vents, drainage pipes, maintenance ducts. Use any available alternative means of escape that you can. Sharon, I've restored some of the data from the Volgus experiment records. According to these records, the facility you're in is the private laboratory of General Amon of the Legion of Immortality. As it was Iron Heart Traces which led us to this place, Corell and Eamon might actually be there. It won't be an easy fight if they are. Sharon? Awaiting your transmission. The traces of the Iron Heart. Detected here. There. Um, never mind. I will let you know after I've performed further analysis. Uh, okay, guide. They've synchronized the alarms with the nuclear reactor self-destruct switch. What the hell are they thinking? They'd rather take everyone and everything with them than give up the Ironheart. I can modify the circuitry. Find the alarms and destroy them. I'll continue tracking the Iron Heart traces. Units transmitting critical operation details. From the restored Volgus experiment records, I've reconstructed an audio recording that seems to have been made during the time of the experiments. Listen. Legion will become greater from the Iron Heart. Rise, my warriors. Give your lives for Clipper. Stand at the vanguard.
Reinhardt's already gone, then. So this is why the trace is felt. Displaced. Descending. In order to increase the accuracy of our pursuit, we need to access all the data on Vulgus units who were transformed using the Iron Heart. You must defeat Alzarok. Sharon, will you relay a detailed report of this to HQ? Will do. I'll be on my way. Good hunting. information that is hard to accept. This Alzarok is one thing, but Karel has ordered for the Iron Heart to be inverted, whatever that means. Inversion. What could that be? be able to decipher the unidentified guide code and Enough! The Iron Heart data must be reconfigured in order to destroy the dimensional wall. I don't have time to think about that! You understand my vision now, don't you? I am only thinking of our research. <coughs> I'm glad to hear that our objectives are aligned. <coughs> Initiate the data inversion. Cliffhoff will engulf Increase. The roars of the Vulgus will fill this land with fear. Descendant, I have the results of the operation from Sharon. Alpha is tied up with an emergency meeting with the Magisters. I have been ordered to brief you on the follow-up operation. Please make your way to HQ.
Magisters are probably humanity's real home, don't you think? Were the Commander's explanations confused? Excellent work, Descendant. This operation has yielded many results, both positive and negative. Firstly, all of HQ is encouraged by the possibilities presented by the Guide. Although we were unsuccessful in our retrieval of the Ironheart, thanks to the Guide's tracking function, we uncovered the Volgus Restricted Zone and Alzerok. This proves the Guide's tracking system exists and is operational. However, the ingenuity that the Vulgus demonstrated with their use of the Ironheart was alarming. So much so, that the Magisters requested an emergency meeting with Alpha. In particular, the inversion of the Ironheart ordered by Corral is something we must understand, no matter the cost. From this point forward, HQ plans to adopt the Guide's tracking functionality and the various other information sources they offer as official operational elements. The Descendants will soon be deployed throughout Ingress. Use the Guide to track the Ironheart and proceed with the mission to investigate the inversion procedure. Humanity's full-scale counterattack has officially begun. However, I know you have just completed a difficult mission. Until the official deployment order is given, please go ahead with whatever preparations you need to make. The Magisters have promised their full commitment to support research efforts, so this is the perfect opportunity to request anything you need from Anais. Before you go, Descendant, I have a personal request. Can you retrieve the Alzerog autopsy report from Jeremy? The report was intended for delivery to the Magisters. Jeremy requested a brief look at it, and I haven't heard from him since. I understand things are strained between you and Jeremy due to the recent operation, but I hope you'll do this anyway. Descendant, just in case, I hope you're not disappointed that Jeremy wasn't punished. I actually saw Alpha slap Jeremy earlier. No one enjoys seeing their superior do something like that but I believe it was a more appropriate punishment than a court-martial. I'm sure that Jeremy... <laughs> Are you...? This operation?
think you're the only one? What the? You're still alive? I was just reading the report on Alzarok and thinking, wouldn't it be great if he, you know, killed you? Anyway, looks like he got to experience something interesting at least. A Vulgus redesigned by the Ironheart. Wow. Now, that's an area that fascinates me. If I knew you'd be seeing that, I would have stuck with the operation instead of dropping out. And I wouldn't... Anyway, why are you here? I'm in a bad enough mood already after... What? Ah, so you're her gopher. You really... You probably... All these... we returned to Albion, I leapt between the Archae of different descendants in order to find Ironheart traces. I discovered traces in the desert and forest areas, and at that moment, in human terms, it felt like my skin was descendant. I suspect this phenomenon is caused by an inversion process. If Corel and Eamon had an... However, aside from this pain, I was unable to... For the properties of the Iron Heart to change a tremendous amount. Void dimension link detected. Colossus is broken. I repeat. Void dimension link detected. Descendant. A Colossus has appeared. This Colossus. The ancestors always removed. My thoughts are all muddled. It would be best to focus on the Colossus for now, Descendant. As the. Classification type. Stunning beauty. All descendants in Albion. Prepare for an intercept battle. <laughs> They're arriving on the daily, and not just any Colossus, but- Descendants, the Colossi, although the expected time of arrival, stunning beauty, but now, Descendant- <laughs> The space-time fabric of the Void is extremely illogical.
transcendent, you have been successful. We live in uncertain times, but thankfully the skills of the descendants remain stable and unchanged. Even if using the word stable in our current situation is embarrassingly ironic, the dimensional wall we must find close in it. I suppose everyone thinks the dimensional wall is the only answer. Are you saying it isn't? I cannot say whether it is or not. As we do not have an iron heart, nothing can be proven. You think too much. We should find a heart and prove it then. I'm pretty sure there's one in Vespers. Traces from another Iron Heart have been discovered in a forest in Vespers. I've already spoken with HQ. Let's discuss operation strategies. Come with me. I was wondering who it was. It was you? Sorry, I know you probably wanted some rest after taking out that Colossus. Anyway, like I said over comms, we've discovered Ironheart traces in Vespers. I had business to attend to with the Order of Truth, so I was hunting down some Vulgus there. Suddenly, the guide appeared, claiming she felt the pulse of an Ironheart in the area, and then simultaneously in multiple areas. According to the guide, these multiple signals weren't byproducts of the Ironheart like Alzarok was. Comparing it with the data we have now, there really seems to be a difference. Now, well, it's obvious, isn't it? We have no other choice but to check every single location she's detected. When I came back to HQ to report on my operation, they told me to take reinforcements. And I chose you. Jeremy makes me very uncomfortable. But I have no trouble trusting you. So, you in? I'll take your silence as consent. I knew you'd accept, even if you didn't actually say it. We'll head to the Vespers outpost once you're ready. It'll give Dr. Glay time to join us. The space-time fabric of the Void is extremely illogical.
Thank <laughs> you. 